So the first page that you're going to see after running the setup file is the license agreement page. Here, we'll need to accept the terms of this license agreement. Optionally, you can join the customer experience program, but this is not mandatory in order to move on. Go ahead and click proceed. Now on this page, we'll have the different options to select with our installation. By default, it's going to install the backup agent and the management server. We also have the ability to customize the installation settings. This will give you options to change the port number or if you have a proxy server. But for this demo, we're just going to install a backup agent and the management server. We'll go ahead and click install. And after a few minutes, it'll display this page showing us the installation was successful. We're also going to see the web address for the management console. You can select this link here or just hit close and it'll open up the management console for us. All right, now here we are at the management console. Now the first thing that we wanna do here is go down to the bottom where it says start trial, click on that. And on this window, We'll go ahead and just enter in the email address and password that you use to sign up with an Acronis account. And that'll begin the 30-day trial.